gotta eat before I go out. I'm hungry. I forgot practice is at 5 today. We had breakfast after we landed at 9 a.m. And I haven't really eaten again today. So I'm kind of hungry right now. You look grossed out by me making the sandwich. Oh, I forgot. You like your sandwiches dry with no mustard or mayonnaise on it. Anyway, we are here at Gateway. This is one of my favorite tracks that we go to in the season. I've had some pretty decent runs here. I've raced Canyon in here in the past. I've raced Arca. I've had quite a few laps here, so I feel like it's one of those tracks where I know a lot about it. And it's just fun. It's the only circle track that we actually shift at, which is very, very rare, and it makes it exciting. It's different. It's just, a, it has a little twist on it, you know? So uh, we got practice and qualifying today, uh, race tomorrow. So it's about 90 degrees out right now. It is baking outside. So I've been staying in here, just trying to stay cooled off, but it's not getting any cooler. It's just hot right now. It's 5 p.m. <laughs> Into three and four, made a mistake, but we got a long race to get it all sorted out. The truck is really, really good. I'm really confident in it, and it just be, it felt really good in practice. And I was really happy with the changes that we made. We improved on the fine-tuning things I think the truck needed. And I think today it's going to be hot. It's going to be very similar to how it was in practice, track temperature-wise. And I think we're on a really good day. The Ford Performance Ford from Temecula, California. There you go. The little kid they sent out with me, he wasn't paying attention and then he was talking to his little buddy and they like grabbed him real quick and um, like told him to come next to me and he looks at his buddy and goes oh, like trying to get his attention of not oh. saying like look who I'm with but like he trying to get, get his friend to acknowledge it. It was so funny. His friend goes oh, Haley! <laughs> yeah, watching, watching Hayden right now qualifying. Sucks. It's like a midday race for him, and it's a midday race for me on the same day. So it's I'm gonna just keep him with my race when his first race will be starting. So I'm gonna have to get out real quick, pull it up. Hopefully have service to pull it up. Right now he's qualifying though, so I'll be able to see his full qualifying before we actually get in the truck. No, I'd say we support each other really good. I know what he does is super dangerous and super tough. A tough sport to be in either way. Motorsports is all around is very competitive. So uh, I support him as much as I can. Always tell him good luck for every race. Try to talk to him, give him a little pep talk and stuff. He's young, he's only 17, but he's accomplished so much for his age. Oh, I love to hear the whole brother, sister love going on. What are you expecting on today's track? Yeah, I think we have a really good truck. In practice, we were pretty fast. I feel like the truck had really good speed. Uh, we made a few 
changes. I feel like we improved the balance overall. Uh, just with it being so hot, I don't think it's ever been this hot when I've been to the track before. So I think we made some really positive changes. In qualifying, I messed up three and four. We had a good lap going off of uh, turn two, but made a little mistake. So we're going to be starting a little further back than I want to be. But overall, I'm really, really confident in the track. crazy that those things can just float in the air. I oh, don't know, it amazes me. <laughs> that was pretty cool. That was definitely one of the coolest ones. Let me know what you need. Okay. Let me know if you even tear off water and the whole deal. So just, okay. All right. No problem. All right, one to go here. Let's have some fun today. Nice and smooth here. It's going to be hot. Let's go get them. All right, make sure all your switches where they need to be. Long green this time. Pace car's off here, get ready. Five away. Line, roll it. Green, green, green. We're all rolling here, two wide. It's smooth right here, get your marker, don't overdrive it. Grab it away from those guys behind you, the 88 and the 9. They're two wide back there, seven back. Going away from me right there, so a couple of these guys are going to poke out a line, especially to one, and a lot of these guys are going to try and drive it in there to kind of make you overdrive it there. So. Caution, caution, caution. I feel like I'm struggling with the front. Like, the same thing I was dealing with yesterday before we made that last change. It just kind of builds that way. Like, I need the front to work a little bit better in the sand of the corner. I'm having to wait on it a long time. Set up the 23. There you go. Nice work. More clear, clear, clear. Thank you. Nice work. Keep doing just that. You're way fast with these guys right now. Something where she can be aggressive. She can shoot way better than these guys. We're going to be P7 right here. Line rolling green, green, green. In line, in line. 45 is right on you. Get away from those guys. Get all we can here. Get to that bottom. Can you get some of that clean air or two as well? Wide back there behind you, still four bad. That last lap is your fastest lap of the race. Just keep doing what you're doing right here. Inside, top of three. The two is going to come into your rear here, top of three. Top of three, two is coming to your rear, top of two. Inside, 52, hold on, hold the brake, hold the brake, hold the brake, hold the brake. Hold the brake here, girl. Hold the brake, hold the brake. You okay? He's up and watch Nick there with, with a two truck. Yeah, that's totally avoidable. That, uh, you can't just run over someone. Two just shipped us. Believable. He just did not lift. Gracious. Track position, that was our biggest thing. We had a lot of speed. We just couldn't really go anywhere. It was so hard to pass. We finally got track position on a little bit older tires, but it was still pretty even. Like, it wasn't like we were getting ran over or anything. And the two had to run out back, hit me once, and then locked onto me. And I don't even think he slowed down for turn three. Just shit me off. Killed our truck, ended our race. Plain and simple, just shipped us. Absolutely shipped us off. There was no reasoning for it. Like, I don't know. But that's truck series, typical truck series racing. So, I don't know. And literally, this is just a product of all the people in the series. And if you don't race like an asshole, you're the one that gets the bad end of the stick. So it's it goes. It goes both ways. To either swing or be swung at. So, is what it is. Don't growl at me. What? <laughs> what? You're fine. <laughs>